Anyway, guys, so it's a uh, lead dragon here, and um, had an issue with the video, but uh, the one I'm here trying here I got is the Tokyo Treat Box. Came with a little magazine here. I'll see if I can show the box here. But that's it. No, it's kind of backwards, but it's a box here. Pretty big one. I've heard about other YouTubers um, using these, so uh, I've already tried one piece. I tried catching on camera, and it didn't work out. But uh, let me try that. Kind of show. It almost looks like a, almost like a pill, like a pain pill or something. I'm not sure which one this is, but I'll try it here. So this is the one I'm trying here right now. Uh, that one I just ate. Um, I think it's this one right here. I tried capturing that. Yeah, yeah it's kind of hard to see, but uh, it's that one right. I think it's that one right there. Um, but that one kind of reminded me of uh, Smarties. Uh, not that too bad candy. Let's try a different one here. Um, got this one right here. Almost looks like a, like a jelly bean or something. Which, by the packaging, uh, it's this one right here. It looks like, uh, I should take it too fast. Orange. So, let's try that. Alright. Pretty good. Hmm. Next two, take the um, orange one, uh, that's orange flavored, and then this one right here. Try them together. Alright, pretty good. I'm gonna sew this back up. I don't wanna eat them all. <laughs> See, I got the rest of the box to try out, and then, um, uh, drop the bag there, um, my wife and uh, my stepdaughter wants to try some of these too, so gotta leave some for them. Alright. Alright, let's see what else we got here. I'm gonna go off the menu here because I, I don't understand Japanese at all. Uh, I got a sister. I got a sister who um, uh, studied it, but uh, let's see what else we got here. Let's see if we can match the picture. Um. This one we got next, we got this one here. Sorry for the lighting here. Uh, look at some... The package says, uh, cheese taste. Um, it looks like the package may be some kind of Cheetos or something. Um, I, mean, I can't pronounce this, I'm bad at pronouncing some words, but this one's, uh, U-M-A-I-W-A -A cheese. Uh, that's a puffering, corn puffering, flavored by cheese fondue. Let's get it out of the Get out of the way. Yeah, it does smell like, um, Cheetos. Or not Cheetos, like, you know, cheese puffs, like off brand or something. Oh, it is kind of like um, like off-brand cheese puffs or something. Which I'm not too big a fan on uh, cheese puffs here, but but it's pretty good. I'm gonna make here on my got my computer desk here. Um, what else we got here? Um, this one's like corn on a cob. And butter. Yeah, if I can uh, stretch that up a little bit. But that's another one here. Um, this one looks like some kind of corn chips. You know, kind of like long lines. Uh, looks chips look like kind of like um, Doritos or something. But, uh,.
Let's see here. Um, Don Tacos Grilled Corn Flavor. Inspired by a popular grilled corn dish in Japan. Hmm. I kind of want to visit Japan, uh, especially like Tokyo. Yeah. Let's try this one here. So far, um, I like all of them. I can't find one that I haven't found that I didn't like yet, but um, kind of smells kind of odd. But here we go. You know what here? It's kind of a weird taste. Yeah. Taste. Now it does um. Tastes like it says in the description. And it does kind of taste like you're eating um, corn from a can. But not bad. Not something I think it would eat. But put that offside. Um. Next one we got here, um, it was Easter theme, so there's some Easter theme stuff here, but it uh, looks um, Mickey Mouse on it, uh, Donald Duck, um, let's see what this one is, um, that's Gutuma. Candy? I'm probably butchering that name, so forgive me there. Uh, it's a tasty yogurt flavored treat with filled with a rich orange sauce. Good yeah, facial expressions are on them. Hmm. Okay. Give it a whirl. Roll. Yeah. Can't pronounce. I can't mispronounce my words here. Um. Oh, let's, I can see that. It's snow White. Oh, it looks like a kind of like a cookie. Oh, this one's kind of like vanilla. Get that filling in it. Oh, it kind of reminds me of those um, those sandwich cookies um. You got the two cookies, and then you get that kind of cream in the center, kind of like um, Oreos, but but it's not bad. Uh, let's see what this one is. I like the um all these ones with the Disney characters on it are the same flavor. This one has um ah oh, I forgot. I can't think of her name. She was with uh, Donald Duck in some cartoons. And there's Mickey on it again. I'll give this first one up. It might be the same thing, but right here. Donald Duck now. Yeah, pretty much the same thing. Okay, tasting, but uh, that's all we got here. It's kind of a big bag. Um, uh, let's type a potato chip. But no idea yeah, what it is. But this is it right here. Trying to get it in there. Uh, I don't recall seeing anybody reading the book as they do this, but you know, what the heck. <laughs> uh, I think I actually found the right page here. <laughs> um, let's see here. This one is Cowbee Plum Seaweed Chips. Sweet and sour plum. Mm. I don't know about this one. Uh, I'm not sure if I had seaweed before. But... Oh. 
struggling on uh, attack team here. Okay. Pretty ordinary, but I get them bland there. Let's try this one. That bigger chip, maybe more flavor. I'm not getting like a plum taste or I'm not getting seaweed, but of course I haven't really ate. I don't think I've eaten seaweed before, but okay. Not much flavor. Well, to me, there's, that doesn't seem like much flavor to them. But put that one down there. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Ah, here we go. Uh, okay, this one is um. If I can get that one in there. White chocolate. Uh, white chocolate milk tea. Um, I'm personally not a milk, um, a tea drinker. I'm not. I don't like tea very much. But um, I guess it go the same for coffee as well. But uh, yeah, let's try this one. I guess um, doesn't look too. I mean, it kind of almost looks like chocolate milk to me. But, uh, I don't know if this would be better chilled, but, you know, let's go with it. There we go. Probably going to be making a funny face or something. I'm not getting that strong tea smell. Not much, uh, there we go. I can taste the milk. Uh, almost pretty much has like a kind of like milk and water kind of combination. Um, I don't really get too much of a tea. Oh yeah, yeah, I get a faint tea, but actually it's not that bad. I thought it was gonna be worse, like gonna be like gross or something, but I'm only gonna take a couple sips out of this one, but. See how well they like it. <laughs> Just down over here. Uh, what do we got now here? Um, more of those cookie things. Um, hmm. Let's see what this is. Um, really something to do with lemons. Um, look kind of like a square, or like lemon squares or something. Oh, let me get my fingers out of the way. Um, healthy snacking. Oh, I'm, I'm tired here. I just got off of work not long ago from my night job, so I look pretty tired right now. I feel it too. And I wanted to make this video in the morning because uh, it's quiet right now. No one's awake, so give a little time to do this. So let's open this here. Oh, it has more of a Ziploc things on it so that makes it easier you know keep it fresh so trying to fold it but um let's see here oh it's kind of one of those gummies that you know kind of with the sugar on them you can see the little seeds or something in it but yeah not really too big fan of these kind of candies Ooh. Has a pretty strong um, lemon smell. I like lemon. Just and some things I don't like um, certain type of foods and too much of, or I don't like them in certain things. But I'm willing to try things uh, new, new things at least once. So here we go. It's chewy. It's actually pretty good. It kind of reminds me of um, 
It kind of goes along the lines of, uh, if you ever try those, like, gummy, like, lightsabers, or, you know, oh, what would be another one, like, gummy starburst or something. But, yeah. Uh, Alright, I'll drop any air in there. Alright. That was actually pretty good. Some animals just wandering around here. Um, let's see here. Oh, it's like three of them. Well, four of them attached. Um, uh, this one actually has uh, some of it's in English here. Tohato, I'm guessing that's the brand. And uh, it says uh, caramel corn. But yeah, that's it right there. Um, big bad cheat sheet here. It's gotta be on this page here. Maybe it's on this next. Um, oh, here it goes. <laughs> Fasten it. The caramel corn share pack. Sweet caramel flavor with peanuts that dispel instantly. Hmm. I like caramel and like peanuts. So. Let me give it a whirl here. Probably go for that some scissors. But, um, this is what it looks like. Uh, light, it's probably not catching it, but it, um, you definitely kind of see that there's caramel on it. But there we go. It's almost like eating, um, oh, it's a type of cereal. I can't think of the name, but, um, There's nothing to share here, so I'm just gonna put that one off to the side here. And uh, move on. Actually, that's all. The caramel corn is actually pretty good. Let's see what we got here now. Um, teriyaki flavor. Um, looks like it's some kind of gummies. Uh, by touching a little bit, it sounds like almost like some kind of cookie or something. Or, but uh, give it a whirl here. Uh, anime character, uh, burger on there. Maybe it looks like it's some kind of burger place. Um, uh, let's try it here. Oh, it's uh, almost kind of like um, one giant Cheeto or something. Oop. Ah, it's pretty much one solid piece, so you know, a broken piece here. Ooh, that is strong. Uh, kind of like fall on the line, like you know, pork rinds it looks like. But uh, hmm. That's pretty good. Um, so that's that one right there. Now let's see if it has a name in here. Seems like everything's on the second page here. Uh, let's see what we got here. Teriyaki Burger. Oh, so I guess it's supposed to be like teriyaki burger flavor. I mean, I got the teriyaki, you know, this kind of smooth, sweet, kind of salty taste. But, yeah, pretty good there. Um, this one looks like it's one with a, a, a bunny. Uh, bunny. <laughs> wow, I'm sure I want to get, um, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a comment about that. 
about a, yeah, like a bear there of honey. So I'm going to be honey flavored, obviously there. So baby bear gummies. So, oh, I guess it might be just a regular gummy. But, let's get a piece off there. Not really a bear, but um, yeah. <laughs> Take a piece off there. Yep. There you go. Get my little piece there to try. Yeah, it's a good, pretty good flavor. Half uh, fruity. But it's good. I thought it would be like bear shape or something, but that works. <laughs> uh, let's see what we got here now. Hmm. I'll do the, but that's the other thing here. Easter eggs. Kind of mess over here. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Oh, there's a lot of openings here. So, let's see. Let's just open it from the top here. Looks like an egg. I mean, it's kind of squashed, but um, uh, hey, all these cameras are pretty accurate, but can't really smell nothing on it. But uh, here we go. Uh, custard pudding snack. Uh, pudding chocolate balls. Mm. It's okay. Um, it's not nasty. It's just not a not a very good taste. I don't like a taste I like. So, but I just let my uh, stepdaughter here have it. So, <laughs> let's see what else we got here. Oh, a big bag here. Alright, that's the other one we got here. Um, it's banana flavored. I've, I've seen the packaging, so it's Kit Kat. So, hmm. I do like Kit Kat. You, uh, I'll eat the white chocolate or the other ones. Hmm. A lot of banana on there. Oh. Make it easy to share this. So. Give it a whirl. Mm. Hmm. Good banana smell. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look like it uh, melted a little bit there. Or oh, just less, it just came out like that. Not bad. I 
it's okay tasting. But, I mean, I do like banana. It's just like, like I said before, some things um, I don't like to have mixed in with certain foods or I don't like, like, I don't like to have cranberries, juice very much, or sometimes I'll drink it, but I, mean, I just like, you know, certain things separate. But, uh, yeah, it's okay. Alright, next one on the list here. No idea what this is. Egg. So let's do some egg. Ah, let's see if we can get a quick glimpse. So I think it's another type of candy here. Um, but yeah, it looks like some kind of candy drop. So, Hmm. Uh, about that. Oh. I don't know what that is, but I like that very much. Oh. Big pass on that one. Alright, we got one more left there in the box. Uh, this is the one right here. Uh, I got dipping candy. Oh, it's in the tray. Hmm, little banana. Here in the box, but uh, right and put that down there. Sprinkles on it. Picture, but there we go. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah. Cool. That was a strong, yeah. <laughs> but my faces are coming now. But, uh, yeah, that's. Oh. That's, uh, 
Not very good tasting. Right there. Ugh, there's rotten stuff here. Yeah. Oh, I'm making a mess. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, that's kind of a long video, but you know, still kind of getting used to the whole recording thing. And I uh, originally wasn't really gonna plan on kind of doing myself in front of cam, you know, showing myself in front of camera. Uh, I figured, you know, I just do kind of stay behind the camera, and, you know, do some voiceovers and stuff like that. But uh. I uh, just figure, you know, like, I'll, I'll try the whole unboxing thing, you know, with something, some kind of unboxing. But yeah, that was the Tokyo Treat box here for uh, April, with the Easter, Easter theme. But I can say that, um, I like the majority of the treats and stuff in here, even the drink was okay. You know, I'm not a big uh, tea drinker. Um, it was just, uh, um, these guys right here. And uh, this one right here uh, were two of the ones I can say are my least favorite ones out of the bunch. But I like to say uh, thanks for watching here. This is Elite Dragon, and uh, I'll see you guys on the flip side here.